Yeah. Hi everyone. Firstly, I'd like to thank you all for being here yeah. and yeah. Standing, standing up for the future of our beautiful country. Um, I'm pleased to read a short message from someone who couldn't be here, which is Jenny Yates Erickson. Uh, she couldn't attend today because she has a field days up in her organic farm. Hello, I am Jenny Yates Erickson and I run a 200 acre BioGrow certified organic farm in the Waitafeta Valley near Waihi. I'm also a ninth generation seed merchant that started with James Yates in England in 1750, who began a long tradition of spreading seeds around the world. My great-grandfather was Ernest Yates, who with his brother Arthur took the long journey out from England in 1885 to bring seeds to New Zealand and Australia. Ernest had a shop on Queen Street, at the Yates Company, and he used to travel by horse around the North Island selling seeds that anyone could grow and save and grow again and again. In 1911, Ernst purchased land in Karaka and started the first Yates seed farm. Sorry, I'm very nervous. <laughs> in, New Ze <laughs> in New Zealand, where seeds were planted and weeded and harvested by hand. My how times have changed. I too have seeds in my blood. My husband claims there are seeds in every drawer, cupboard, and pocket in the house. I have grown, collected, saved, and replanted and sold seeds from my gardens for over 30 years. Seeds represent one of the most basic forms of life and freedom. The right to grow and save seeds is as fundamental as eating and breathing. Nothing, nothing should ever be allowed to interfere with this right. The TPPA could influence this freedom and have the potential to take away our right to grow and save seed. If anyone here has a garden, this is very important. If large companies have the right to sue our government for loss of profit, our government would quickly establish laws to protect those companies. These laws would eventually stop the use of saved seed and force everyone to buy seed from those who hold seed patents. This would spell the end of home gardens and the end of my business. Large companies like Monsanto have great power and seem to have a goal of taking over the food supply through their genetic modification and seed patenting programs. Biodiversity and natural seed selection is so important for the planet and nature has wisdom that man cannot duplicate. I support the concept of free trade, but the TPPA could give more power to these already very powerful corporations and this could reduce our basic freedoms. No one in their right mind would support this. Thank you, from Jenny Yates Erickson.